an international team of researchers has added to the many ways Lifetime Achievement Award recipient Miles Davis will be remembered. One might think, having 10 albums in the Grammy Hall of Fame means his explorations of new dimensions in jazz will always be preserved, but now his legacy has been encoded on DNA. Leading Swiss Polytechnic EPFL has been working with the Montreux Jazz Festival to address the long-term digital storage of its archive. Joined by researchers from Microsoft, Twist Bioscience and the University of Washington, Davis' performance of Tutu at the festival has been recorded in DNA and played back with complete accuracy. Deep Purple Smoke on the Water was also encoded in synthetic DNA. Now, inspired by fossils, experts are confident that musical data recorded as artificial DNA, the data storage medium used by every protein-based life form, has the potential to literally last for ages, even geological ages. As to why researchers would conceive of storing music in DNA, it has to do with the quality of storage DNA offers. The amount of DNA used to store these songs is much smaller than one grain of sand, said Microsoft senior researcher Karen Strauss, Ph. D. Amazingly, storing the entire six petabyte Montreux Jazz Festival's collection would result in DNA smaller than one grain of rice. How's that for preservation? Grammy Museum Grants Program supports music archiving and preservation. What's going on at the Grammy Museum? Grammy Museum Executive Director Scott Goldman spoke to Billboard recently for a wide-ranging interview about new ways the museum is poised for the future. Going on 10 years exhibiting music history, educating and hosting great programs, the popular LA Live attraction can be pleased it now has a history of its own, attracting 150,000 visitors and 25,000 students last year. We need a refresh, said Goldman, explaining the integrated, online and national approach for the future. We're going to launch a 10th anniversary campaign in 2018. It will lead toward having the resources to do the things we want to do. The museum is dedicated to exploring the enduring legacies of all forms of music the creative process the art and technology of the recording process, and the history of the Grammy Awards, the premier recognition of recorded music accomplishment. Although that's a wide-ranging mission for Goldman, his work for 12 years with Recording Academy Education and Muse Seekers have made him accustomed to its scope. On a personal note, Goldman shared a thank you note from Ozzy Osbourne he received following the 2014 Music Airs Map Fund event, supporting addiction recovery for musicians. Many other memories through the years and through decades of American music will mean more to an even wider reach of visitors, whether at LA Live, Grammy Museum Mississippi, or other museum events and initiatives. Not a Grammy Museum member Learn More Everything is up for Ed Sheeran who bumped Drake from the top spot on Spotify's most streamed song leaderboard. Shape of You climbed to more than 1.318 billion streams, while One Dance didn't keep up at more than 1.317 billion, a difference of more than a million streams. You might say for Sheeran that everything is perfect. Billboard notes back in March, when Sheeran's Divide album was released it received the most first-day streams, more than 56 million, and Shape of You at the same time, had the best one-day Spotify record with 10 million. The same observant I noted the other leaderboard Sheeran has yet to top, most streamed artist overall, a title Drake still holds. It's like an uphill race for most likable, run between two super likables. Ed Sheeran makes Billboard chart history with Shape of You the 19th annual New Orleans Voodoo Music Arts Experience just announced their debut day lineups. Which day are your favorite artists going to be playing the big three leading the roster are Kendrick Lamar, Foo Fighters, and The Killers, but the full lineup for the 2017 edition of this long-running festival is seriously deep this year. The festival bills itself as a musical gumbo stirring together music, art, community, cuisine and all the mystery and adventure that Halloween weekend in New Orleans conjures up. The 2017 edition of the festival will run from October 27-29. Three-day and single-day tickets are available now. Solange, Nine Inch Nails will headline day for Night Festival 2017.